What's up, YouTube? This is Galvatron Omega. We're going to be playing Werewolf Apocalypse Earthblood. Uh, I've been waiting for this game to come out. Hope it lives up to the hype. It looked pretty legit. I'm going to keep the commentary to a minimum, and uh, I hope you guys enjoy the video, and I hope it helps. And don't forget to click that like and subscribe button.
the wild. The weaver. And the worm. Three primal forces from which the world, Gaia, springs. The wild is creation, formless and abundant. The weaver shapes, making order out of chaos. The worm, whose purpose was to destroy the old, to make room for the new, went mad. Now, a force of corruption feeding on greed, malice, and hate. It ravages Gaia. Through its unwitting accomplices, mankind, the balance between those three forces is long gone now. Insidiously, the worm gains more and more ground every day. Vitalized by the damage humans have brought to the Earth. We, the werewolves, remain. Born of man, beast, and spirit. We are the vindication of Gaia and the Wild. The best way to get Indran out of the region is to attack their bottom line. We have a plan to convince them there's no profit to be had here. Ludmilla, if you please. I've recently gained access to the system that controls all the on-site oil pumps. That's our target. We tamper with the pumps and send dummy data to the system to make them think their oil field has run dry. Will that really be enough? According to the internal files I got my hands on, they treat unprofitable sites like gangrenous limbs. They'll give this one the chop right away. I don't know. Even if we do manage to push them out, they'll only set up somewhere else. We need to hurt them, bring them down, not chase them away. We've already talked about this, Kahal. They're too close to the cairn. If we stage an attack, they'll look for the ones who did it. I don't want Indran's eyes on our home. Our best option is to work in the shadows. But if something goes wrong, my wife ends up on her own in enemy territory. I don't like it. I'm going to be fine, Call. We've been preparing this for weeks. We've calculated the risks. And if there's any sign of trouble, you and I go in and retrieve her. But I'd rather we stay covert. Ludmilla will have the easiest time on her own. I'm heading out. I want to be done before daybreak. Take care of Adana while I'm away. I think she's going a little crazy all cooped up in here. Don't worry, I'll talk to her. You just focus on your mission. Call. I've got this. I love you. See you soon. I don't like thinking that Ludmilla's on her own, Rodko. I understand. She's my sister, remember? What about Rafik? He never leaves his lupus shape. No one would have noticed him. I gave it a lot of thought. Her chances of success are better if she's alone. It's as simple as that. If things don't go as planned, you can tear through as much Endron scum as you like to get her out. 
But for now, we stay put. Go. Rest while we wait. Not looking forward to packing all this up tomorrow morning. We've been stuck in this cave for weeks studying Endrin's movements. At least now we finally got a plan. I hope we're done here soon. Endrin. One of the most destructive companies North America has to offer. Known for their violence and endless greed. If we left them to their own devices, they'd ravage this place till there was nothing left but dust. Ava did an impressive job installing all this. I'll have to thank her for this later. Got everything squared away? Not a lot to square away. All I'm doing is pressing a button once Ludmilla gets me hooked up. Still got a ways to go before I can do much more than that. If I tried to breach their network, they'd be on us in a second. Don't be so hard on yourself. You're ten times better at hacking than me or Rotko with your eyes closed. Just give it time. Besides, you installed all of this on your own. Have faith in your abilities. I know, I know, but... Thanks. A little pep talk never hurts. But how are you doing? Talk to your daughter yet? No, not yet. I'm just heading her way. Hey, how you doing? I'm bored out of my mind. There's nothing to do here, and it's wet and miserable. Don't worry, our work here's nearly finished. You'll be back at the cairn with your friends before you know it. I know, but why'd you have to drag me out here in the first place? It's not like you've got me doing anything out here. Your mom wanted you to come along, so you could see what our field missions entail. They entail a bunch of bullshit. All we ever do is watch and take notes. We're not accomplishing anything. Language, young lady. And preparation is key. Know how your enemy will respond before you move. Foe stripped of surprise is fangless. Why didn't you go with Mom anyway? She's all alone out there. If something happens to her... I wish I could've. But Rodko wants us to keep a low profile. And there's no one better at that than your mom. <laughs> Rodko's a dumbass. Hey, that's your uncle you're talking about. And the leader of our pack. You know it's his job to make those decisions. And like I said, all that observation we were doing was minimizing the danger. Your mother will be just fine, Aidy. Don't worry. Oh, shit. Kahal, wake up! We're gonna need you. A helicopter just touched down on the site's landing pad. Apparently it's some Endron exec. Their presence has shaken things up. Shaken things up how? Guard patrols have been changed, and some areas have been locked down, including the one Ludmilla's in. They still haven't discovered her, though. So what's the plan now? The mission's sunk. We go in there, get her out, and wait for things to quiet down. But to get her off site, the locked-off areas need to be manually unlocked, and Ludmilla's stuck on the wrong side. Shit. Fortunately, she has already secured a terminal. She'll guide you to her location over the radio. Go now. Bring her back. There's no time to waste. My sister needs you. Ludmilla, I'm on my way. Remember, stay out of sight. I'll open any door I have access to through their network. I've opened all the external ducts.
turbine room in the center of the site. You'll have to get here without being seen. The area you're passing through should be deserted right now, though. Door's locked. Ava? There's gotta be a terminal close by. Find it. Oh, and uh, deactivate any cameras you see while you're at it. Guards. Ludmilla, we've got a lot of company. The arrival of the Endron exec has changed their setup. Tell me where you are. I'm looking at the southern part of the outer fence. And a shit ton of guards. There's no way I'll be able to make a move without being seen. Southern part of the outer fence. Got it. There. That's distract them for a few minutes. But if a guard does see you... He won't live long enough to raise the alarm. They sold their souls to Endron. They don't no. get any mercy. Hell of a time for a malfunction. I'll go check it out. Upstairs, want everything to be perfect. <coughs> Should have picked another job. In the refinery. Perfect. I'm not far now. Nearly at the passageway leading into it. Shit! Something's following me. What is it? But Miller, just hold on. Fuck. Rodko. I heard. The horse sneaking around. 
around. We fight. Now go. I'll meet you with Rafiq. I'm done fucking around.
Ludmilla. Uh, call. Tell Adi. <laughs> No! Please, no! Listen to me! Oh, damn it! No. You need to fight the rage. Oh, that's for feet! Stop it! No! What have I done? Rafik? There's no time to mourn. We need to go. Just reported back to base. Not that there's anything to report. No kidding. Though I guess we've got a special guest coming tonight. Yeah, an engine rep, no less. She should be here soon. You know they're hiring, right? Think you'd ever make the move to Endrin? Hey, what the? Clear dusk. We're good to go. Five years ago, I abandoned the woods of Tarker's Mill. I abandoned my cairn. Endrin killed my wife. I gave in to rage. The worm touched my soul. I had to leave my daughter, 
It was the hardest decision I ever made. And in other news, Andrin is joining the fight against global warming. The energy company today announced that their new biofuel will be hitting the market soon. This revolutionary new formula will be unveiled alongside the opening of their new headquarters in... This exile was my only choice. I'd become a danger to my pack. I often wonder what's become of them. Of Rodko, of Ava, of 80. This is the closest I've been to Tucker's Mill in five years. How much time do we have before they notice the guards on the outside have gone quiet? They report in by radio every hour. That's our deadline for getting our hands on the explosives and getting out of here. Let's go through the plan again, just to make sure everything's clear. You've got to swap the delivery label on the crate of explosives intended for Ender. You do that, and they'll load us up with smiles on their faces. All you've got to do is open the gate to their delivery bay for me. I'll create a diversion while you're exchanging the labels. Got it. We'll have to play it tight, though. One hiccup and the plan falls through. We'll have you sneak around back by their storage facility. Security should be pretty thin there, especially if you go through the ventilation docks. What do your clients intend to do with them anyway? The weather stormers? They're planning on blowing up a big Magadon pharmaceutical plant. Good fucking riddance. I know Magadon's methods. They're the scum of the earth. And guess what? These explosives were originally headed to Endrin, another megacorp of assholes. Stealing from them is just icing on the cake. All right. I'm off. Hey, before you go, are you sure you're up for this, man? You seem kind of stressed out back in the truck. Just been a long time since I've been out this way. Brings back memories. Forget it. We've got a job to do. Right. If you need me, I'm just a chirp away. Good luck, brother. Once orders are packed in the delivery bay and ready to go. Let's do our inventory checks for next month. Inside. Good. Try to keep a low profile, would you? Henry reach 
reached out to me, you know. They're hiring and the pay's pretty good. I'm sure it is. They're going toe-to-toe -to -toe with a group of activists right now. Lambda mankind. If I were you, I'd stay here. Keep your head down. about their new biofuel. They say they're going green by the end of the year. The only thing green about that fuel is the label. It's the same shit with new branding, a marketing stunt. Anybody that... <laughs> They're not running the most attractive operation here. I mean, they're pumping out weapons for Endron, not selling timeshares. Looks probably aren't their priority. Made it to the delivery bay. Good. See that command post next to the gate? You should be able to open things up for me from there.
Dusk, you're up. On it. Once I've got their attention, you go find what we came for and slap on this fancy new delivery label. Got it? According to the intel we received, the crates of explosives should be stored around here. Alright, Dusk. The delivery label's been switched. Then it's time for us to get the hell out of Dodge. Wait. I smell something. Give me a minute to check it out. I knew I smelled it. Silver. Whoever ordered this intends to kill Garu. Dusk. They're shipping out silver bullets. You know what that means. Change of plans? Change of plans. I need to find out who's buying these bullets and why. Buy me some more time. is meeting with upstairs she's from andrin here for the special order the silver bullets who even uses that shit is she picking up some golden guns while she's at it you know what they say the client is king especially when the client's name is andrin Shouldn't be much longer. You were supposed to have come with ammunition. 
one week ago. One week. Endrin doesn't like waiting. Or paying, clearly. You're not getting anything until Endrin is paid up. You can tell that to your President Watkins in person. I don't think you understand what's at stake here. <laughs> oh, I understand that you've just been attacked and you're looking to hit back. I also understand that you need our ammunition to do that. And we've got that ammunition right downstairs. Ready and waiting to go. As soon as you've paid us. Sorry, Major. The business is business. Well, fuck you two. Then we'll attack Tarker's Mill without your help. And rest assured, Mr. Watkins will hear about this. Tarker's Mill. Hey! You and I need to talk. Dispatch, no. we got trouble. Die! Bollocks! Security! Alert! <laughs> Dusk. What the fuck are you doing, Go? I just had to pop a couple guards who wanted to put a bullet in my head. Get the fuck back here already. Sorry, but I didn't have a choice. Keep the engine running. We're out of here as soon as I get back.
alarm went off in the boss's office, but I'm not getting any response from that sector. Take your positions, people. Maximum alert until the situation's clear. <laughs> Come <laughs> on. 
Hold on. What the hell? Hands up! Excited.
too late. Engine is already here. What do we do? Stop the truck. What's even down there? My home. Dusk, stay out of this. Wait! Call! Rodko! Rodko, they've cleared our northern line. They have an exo. We'll take care of the wounded later. We have to stop them. Let's go! Move! <laughs> Tell me, where's Adana? Don't worry, Cahal. Your daughter didn't fight this battle. How are your wounds? Riddled with silver. I'll take days to heal. But things would have been far worse if you hadn't stepped in. I just did what I had to do. Nothing more. I honestly never thought I'd see your face again. Why'd you come back, Cahal? I heard that the Cairn was going to be attacked. I was afraid for you. For Adana. And how did you hear that? I overheard Endrin talking about it on my last job. I may have left Tarker's mill, but I never turned my back on it. I couldn't just abandon you. You found it easy enough five years ago. Your Cairn and your daughter have always needed you. I tried to tell you that. Where is she, Rotgo? With Ava. Working undercover at the biggest Indran site in the Pacific Northwest. The best option available to us after the failure of our last mission. Your last mission? What do you mean? You remember the old abandoned mine not far from here? Indran bought it and turned it into a training center for their new recruits. I launched an attack to wipe them out, but Tank Girl stopped us. The woman you saw in the exo during the attack, she drove us back. Tank girl, you call her. I encountered her during my last mission. She was trying to buy silver bullets from an arms dealer. That's where I learned she was planning an attack on the Cairn. Major Grainer. That's the name her men give her. But to us, she's Tank Girl. And she leads Endron's troops with about as much grace. Their attack on the Cairn was their first wave of revenge for our attack on the training center. We managed to repel them this time, but it's only a temporary victory. They might return at any moment, and Endrin just keeps recruiting soldiers. Then we've got to go back to the mine and destroy their training center. It's the only way to buy the Cairn any sort of safety, no matter how brief. Go back? No. Not until I'm well again. Then we can strike. I'll take care of that goddamn training center myself. You know I can handle it on my own. No. You're no longer a part of this pack. It's my responsibility. 
And how long will it take for you to get better? Days? Weeks? If they return, the cairn will fall. Huh. I'll think about it. Go pay your respects to your Fen, and come back to me. Then, we'll talk about the mine. Hey guys, thanks for watching the video. Be sure to click that like and subscribe button below. Um, and feel free to comment and let us know if this was helpful for you or if there's something that you'd like to see us do differently. And be sure to check back. We'll uh, post videos just as soon as we possibly can. Until next time, keep on gaming.